Hari Lai. You have to bend down to camera level. Can you pass my phone? Good morning. Good morning. So we are giving a combined class. Surprise! I'm, I'm teaching today and me and Manali would be practicing as a good student. Always good student. Yes. So we, we hope you enjoy. Spread the word around. Let's get more people today. Hope there are no technical issues. All of us, all of you can hear us. Good morning. Good morning. Awesome. Okay, good. Yes, is off, right? Huh? Your, your life is off. Yeah. We have three more minutes. Can do start doing small movements. Move your arms, move your head, Today we are teaching a lot of side stretches, practicing a lot of side stretches. Parsha Konasana, its variation, lunging side stretches, uh, Utkatasana side stretches, um, Virabhadrasana two side stretches. Let's see how it goes. Good. Please come to the top edge of the mat. Keep your feet together. Arms by the side of the body. Shoulders back. Take your tailbone slightly in and lift your chest up. And keep your eyes closed. Take three slow deep breath in and out. Connecting with the body. Feel your body from your feet 
to the top of the head. Become aware of the state of the body. How do you feel physically in the morning? Feel your whole body. And pay attention to breath. How the body is breathing. Become aware of the state of mind. How do I feel at this moment? We chant three ohms. Bring your palms to the middle of the chest. Inhale slowly and deep. Slightly separate your feet and take your arms over the head. Interlock the fingers, palms facing up. As you inhale, keeping the heels on the floor first, stretch your arms. Take your tailbone in and lift the sides of the body. Stretch both the sides of the arms. Exhale, back of the palms resting on the head. Inhale, now lift your heels off the floor and then stretch your arms. Exhale, heels on the floor, back of the palms resting on the head. Inhale, heels off the floor, take the tail body, stretch your arms. Exhale. We do three more rounds, in third round we hold for some time. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Last round. Inhale. Stretch. So you can stretch from the sides and lift yourself up. Coming on to the balls of the foot. It's okay if you lose balance, you can always come back. Keep breathing when you're holding the posture. Keep breathing. Good. Release. Release your arms. And then separate your feet. Now take your arms over the head. Hold your elbows. Get the same way. Press the feet down. Activate your legs. Take your tail body. Lift the sides of the body. Inhale. With the exhalation, bend your right. Make sure that the body is in one plane. Inhale to center. Exhale to the other side. Inhale. Exhale. Keep the legs active throughout. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Keep stretching the elbows to the ceiling. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. One last round. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale to your left. 
inhale the scent, exhale, release your arms. And keep your feet together, feet together. Inhale, stretch your arms over the hip, palms facing each other, four fingers together. Exhale, bend forward. You can bend the knees in the beginning. Inhale, arms stretch over the head. Exhale, bend forward. Inhale, arms stretch over the head. Exhale, bend forward. Inhale. Each time when you are stretching the arms over the head, work on stretching from the base of your shoulder blades. Exhale. Inhale, arm stretch up. Exhale, bend forward. Inhale, last round, inhale. Exhale, bend forward. You can keep your palms at the back of the legs. Palms at the back of the legs. Pressing the palms against the back of the legs. And consciously breathe in and out. Work on longer exhalation. When you are exhaling, draw the abdomen in, tighten the pelvic floor and exhale out. Inhalation. Move your breath to the chest. Expanding the chest. Exhale. Exhale out completely from the lower abdomen. Pull the lower abdomen in to push the breath out. Exhale out completely with inhalation. Stretch your arms again over the head. Exhale, bend forward. Keep your palms to the side of your feet. Inhale to so take your right leg back. Straighten the right leg. Push the hip down. Hold your breath. Left leg back to plant. <coughs> Exhale, knees, chest and chin down. Keeping the legs together, inhale, slide the body forward to cobra. Take your toes in, exhale, push your hip back to Parvadasana. Inhale, right foot in between palms. Push your hip down, straighten the back leg. Exhale, left leg in front. Inhale, stretch your arms over the head. Work on stretching both the sides of the body. Exhale, bend forward. Inhale, left leg back. Holding the breath, right leg back to plank. Exhale, knees to stick, chin down. Legs together, inhale, slide the body forward to cobra, shoulders back and down. Exhale, pushing hip back to seat. Inhale, left foot in between palms, straighten the right leg, pushing hip down. Exhale, left leg in front. Bend forward. Inhale, arms stretch over the head. Exhale, bend forward. Inhale, right leg back. Hold your breath to plant. Exhale, knees to extension down. Legs together, inhale to cobra. Exhale, push your hip back, Parvadasana. Inhale, right foot in between palms. Exhale, left leg in front. Inhale, stretch your arms over the head. Exhale, bend forward. Inhale, left leg back. Hold the left to plant. Exhale, knees to stand chin down. Inhale, to cover. Exhale, cover that. Inhale, left foot in between palms. Exhale, right leg in Inhale, arms stretch over the head. We have three more rounds. Exhale, inhale, hold it. Exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale right in front, exhale left in front, inhale, exhale, 
inhaler hold exhale inhale exhale inhale exhale inhale exhale right inhale hold the exhale inhale exhale <coughs> inhale right exhale inhale exhale inhale left hold it exhale inhale exhale inhale left exhale inhale have one more option exhale back four inhale right hold it exhale inhale exhale right inhale exhale inhale exhale inhale left hold it exhale inhale exhale inhale left exhale inhale exhale release your arms connect with your breath take three breaths slow and deep breath one more breath Your eyes open. Again, arms by the side of the body. With inhalation, stretching the arms from the sides. Bring your arms over the head, palms together. Looking at your thumbs. Active legs, tailbone tucked in. Exhale. Stretch your arms from the sides. Bend forward. You need to keep the palms at the back of the legs, or you can keep the palms on the floor. Inhale. Lift the chest up. Keep your back straight. Look in front. Hold your breath. Jump back or step back to plank. Exhale. Chaturanga or knees, chest and chin down. Inhale. Upward facing dog. Lift the chest up. Push the hip down towards the floor. Keeping the knees off the floor. Exhale. Downward facing dog. And stay in downward dog. Keep your feet as wide as your hip. Palms in line with the shoulders. Press the fingers down. Lengthen the sides of the body. If you feel your calf is tight, you can lose. You can start lifting one heel off the floor. Press the heel down, the other heel off the floor. Few times. Press both the heels down. Exhale out completely. Bend your knees. Inhale to jumbo step. In between palms. Inhale to jumbo step. In between palms. Back straight. Look in front. You see the exhalation and bend forward. Abdomen coming close to your thighs. Inhale. Stretching the arms to the sides. Bring your palms together over the head. Exhale. Bend forward. Inhale, back straight, look in front. Palms grounded, jump back or step back to plank. Exhale, to other end. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Again, stay in downward dog. Press the heels down, press the palms down. Externally, rotate your upper arms. 
lengthen the size of the body. We will gently push the chest towards the floor, maintaining the length of your spine. Lift your tailbone up, pointing into the seat. You get maximum length of the sides of your body. Develop the awareness of the sides of the body. Good. Exhale out completely with the inhalation, jump or step in between palms. Keep your back straight with the inhale. Exhale, bend forward. Abdomen to thighs. Inhale, one more round. Stretch your arms over the head. Arms together. You are looking at your thumbs. Connect with your body. Exhale, bend forward. Inhale, back straight. Look in front. Palms grounded. Jump back or step back. Exhale, to other end. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Stay down with dog. You consciously breathe in and out, keeping the body active. Slowing down the inhalation, slowing down the exhalation. When you are inhaling, let the breath move to your chest, expanding the ribcage. When you are exhaling, tighten the pelvic floor, draw the abdomen in, push the breath completely out. Long inhalation. And complete exhalations. Exhaling out completely, tighten the pelvic floor. With inhalation, jumbo step in between parts. Keep your back straight, look in front of Ardha Uthanasana. Use your exhalation. Move to Uttanasana, foot forward. We are moving to Utkadasana. Inhale, bend your knees and stretch your arms all the way. Keep the knees together, thighs together. Look at your thumbs. Exhale, Uttanasana, bend forward. Inhale, back straight. Palms grounded, jump back, step back. Exhale, Chaturim. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing top. Long inhalation. Bring your right foot in between palms. Keep your back heel off the floor. Arms stretched over the hip. Push the hip down. Activate your back leg. Lift the sides of the body. Long inhalation. Palms on the floor. Right leg back to each other. Inhale, upward facing top. Point the feet out. Exhale, downward facing dog. Long inhalation, bring your left foot in between palms. Right heel off the floor. Push the hip down, arms stretched over the hip. Without bending the back knee, straighten the back leg. Push your left hip down. Right hip lift up. Long exhalation, leg back to Chaturanga Dandasana. Inhale, upward facing dog, point the feet down. Exhale, downward facing dog. Stay down with dog. Keep the whole body active and connect with the whole body. Palms, arms, shoulders. Since we are focusing on the sides of the body today, lateral stretch. Keep connecting with the sides of the body. Keep lengthening the sides of the body. At the same time, stretching the back of the legs by pressing the heels down. Exhale out completely. With inhalation, jump or step in between palms. Keep your back straight to the front. Use your exhalation and bend forward. Inhale, moving to Uttanasana. Knees bent, arms stretched over there. Exhale, Uttanasana. Bend from the hip, bend forward. Inhale, Ardha Uttanasana. Palms grounded, weight of the body on your palms, jump back or step back. Exhale to Chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Long inhalation, bring your right foot in between palms. Back heel off the floor, wider stance, 
arm stretched over the head. That comes with one inhalation, long exhalation, leg back to Chadrayu Dandasana. Inhale up dog, exhale down with dog. Long inhalation, <coughs> left foot in between palms, right heel off the floor, arm stretched over the head. Long exhalation, leg back to Chadrayu Dandasana. Inhale up dog, active legs, chest lifted up, shoulders back. Exhale, downward facing dog. Stay down with dog. Consciously breathe in and out. Each breath with your left foot. Slowing down inhalation. Slowing down exhalation. One more breath. Exhale out, tighten the pelvic floor. With the inhalation, jump a step in between palms. Back straight to the hip plane. Exhale, abdomen to thighs. Inhale, Utkadasana, knees bend, arms stretch over the Exhale, Uttanasana, bend forward. Inhale, lifting the chest up, keeping the back straight. Palms grounded, gym back or step back. Exhale, Chadaringa. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down. Inhale, right foot in between palms, long inhalation. To be Rabhadrasana, one to the back feet off the floor. Long inhalation, leg back to Chadaringa Dandasana. Inhale up dog, exhale down with facing dog. Long inhalation, left foot in between palms, right heel off the floor, push the hip down, back leg straight. Exhaling, back to Chadrayana Dandasana. Inhale up dog, exhale down with facing dog. Again, working on your breath, keeping the body active. Expand your awareness to your whole body. Exhale out, tighten the pelvic floor with inhalation. Jumbo step in between palms. Your back straight. Use the exhalation to bend forward, abdomen to thighs, chest to the knees. Inhale, Utkadasana, knees bent, arms stretched over the head. Exhale, bend forward. Inhale, back straight, palms grounded, jump back, step back. This is the last round. Exhale, reach other leg. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. This round will keep the heel off on the floor. Inhale, right foot, close to your right palm, back heel on the floor. Arms stretched over the hip. Push the hip down. Bring your left hip in line with your right. Exhaling, back to the ring <coughs> Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down facing dog. Long inhalation, left foot close to your left palm. Right heel on the floor. Arms stretched over the hip. Long exhalation, leg back to the ring Inhale, point the feet out, upward facing dog. Exhale, down the facing dog. You can either stay down the facing dog. If you want to drop the knees down, sit back on your heels. Catch some breath. You can sit back on your heels. Minimize the movements and stay still. Stay with your breath. Stay with the sensations of the body.
Good. Then stretch your arms out in front. Keeping the arms stretched with inhalation. Coming onto your arms, push the hip down. Lift the chest up. Knees off the floor. Take your toes and exhale. Push the hip back, seat down, facing down. Inhale, stretch your right leg to see. Exhale, bring your right foot in between palms. Right foot in between palms. Keep your back heel on the floor. As you inhale, take your left palm at the back of your left leg. Align the left with your right hip and stretch your right arm up and back. Lift the right side of the body up and breathe in and out. Slowing down the breath. Now inhale, as you exhale, keep your right forearm on your right hand, keeping the left leg and left side of the body and left arm in one leg. Keep stretching the left side of the body. From the outer edge of your left foot to your left fingertips, stretch the whole body. Keep breathing. It's an easy posture. You can stay a little bit longer. You can work on lifting the chest up, taking the tailbone slightly in. Your left leg is active, left side of the body is active. And use your right arm and push the body away from the right thigh. Good. As you inhale again, take your left arm. At the back of your left leg, stretch your right arm up and back. Exhale. Take both the palms, either side of your foot. Inhale, right leg back, either to plant or you can lift it up to ceiling. Exhale, chaturanga. All knees just tension down. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, left leg lift up. Exhale, bring your left foot in between palms and keep your right heel on the floor. With inhalation, take your right palm at the back of your right leg. Stretch your left arm up and back. Keep both the hips in one line facing out to the side. Actively stretching the left side of the body. Consciously breathe in and out. Inhale, with exhalation, place your left forearm on your left thigh, stretch your right arm, pressing the outer edge of the right foot, actively, lift the right side of the body, from the outer edge of the right foot, your right fingertips, it's just one line. You can minimize the arch of your dog back by taking the tail body, at the same time lift your chest up. And your left shoulder moving away from the left side of the neck. Good. As you inhale, take your right palm, the back of your right leg, stretch your left arm up and back. Exhale, place both the palms here, the side of your foot. Inhale, left leg back, either to plant or you can lift. Lift the leg to the ceiling. Straighten both arms. Exhale. One leg chadrendra. Or you can go to knees to tension down. Inhale upward facing down. Exhale downward facing down. Stay downward dog. Breathe in and out. Exhale out completely, head in the pelvic floor with inhalation, general step in between palms. Keep your back straight to the Uttanasana. Exhale, Uttanasana. Now we move to half chair with inhalation, bend your knees and stretch your arms in line with the body. Stretch your arms in line with the body. Take your tailbone slightly in and actively stretch both arms. Activate stretch both arms and breathe in and out. If you are comfortable, 
When you tie is almost parallel to the floor, move your knees forward. Let your knees cross over the toes. It's totally safe. And keep the back of the neck in line with the rest of the spine. Now we inhale with exhalation, straighten the legs and bend forward. Inhale, back straight to the inhale. Palms grounded, jet back or step back. Exhale to other end. Point your feet out, inhale upward facing dog. Exhale downward facing dog. Inhale, stretch your right leg to see. Exhale, right foot. In between palms. You can make the stance a bit short by dragging the left forward. But it's still not short stance, it's medium stance. With inhalation, straighten the right leg and stretch your arms at shoulder. Align the hip, both the hips facing out to the side. Exhale. With the inhalation, take your left palm in the back of your left leg. Right arm stretched out. Actively stretching the right side of the body, keeping both the legs stretched. Inhale, with exhalation, cut from the right hip, reach further out, drop your right palm on your right knee, both the hips in one line, and you can stretch your left arm parallel to the floor. Left arm parallel to the floor. Slide your right palm without Closing the body without moving the left side of the body towards the floor. Keep breathing in and out. Good. As you inhale, take your left arm again, the back of your left leg, stretch your right arm up and back, both the legs stretch. Exhale, bend your right knee and take both the palms, see the side of your foot. Inhale, right leg back, either to plank or lift it up to seat. Exhale, reach the ring up. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, down facing dog. Inhale, left leg lifted up. Exhale, bring your left foot in between palms. Right heel on the floor, keeping the mid stance medium. With inhalation, First, stretch your arms at shoulder. Align both the hips facing out to the side. Exhale. With the next inhalation, take your right arm at the back of your right hip. Stretch your left arm up and back. Without opening the arm. Stretch. Keep both the legs active. Now inhale. With exhalation, cut from the left hip, reach further out and bend forward, bend to the side. Keep your left palm on your left leg. You can stretch your right arm parallel to the floor. Keep both the hips in one line, both the legs active. Breathe in and out. So you can create more space between the left hip and left arm. Hip. With the next inhalation, we take the right palm at the back of the right leg, stretch the left, stretch the left arm up and back. Exhale, bend the left knee, take both palms either side of your foot. Inhale, left leg back. Exhale to Chadrin. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Three breaths, slow and deep breaths, and downward dog. Exhale out completely. With inhalation, you are jumping either side of your palms. Or you can step either side of the palms. Keeping the feet slightly turned out to side, keep your knees. And your feet in the same line. Push the hip back, your thighs parallel to the floor. Interlock the fingers. As you stretch your arms, 
how pushing it back. Thighs parallel to the floor, your upper body parallel to the floor. Actively stretching this, both the sides of the body. Breathe in and out. It's slightly challenging, so you can stay here for some more time. If you're comfortable, you can even stretch the arms, separate your arms and stretch. Good. Release, palms on the floor. Inhale, jump back or you can step back. Exhale, the chaturanga or knees, just tension down. Point the feet out, inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, stretch your right leg to sit. Exhale, bring your right foot in between palms. Drop your left knee on the floor. Now your right foot is in line with your right hip. Left knee is in line with your left hip. Press the top of your left foot down, push it hip down. Make sure that your right knee is not going out to the side. Now from there, hold your left wrist. Lift the left side of the body up. But make sure that you are not pushing the, you are not arching the spine too much. You can take the tailboard slightly in. Now inhale. With exhalation, bend your right. Keep activating your back leg, that will give you a better posture. Breathe in and out. Keep pushing the hip down, keep activating the back lower leg. Inhale, with the exhalation, release your arms, palms either side. Inhale, right leg back, either to plant or lift it up to seal. Exhale, Chaturanga. <coughs> All knees just in chill now. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down facing dog. Inhale, left leg lift left. Exhale, bring your left foot in between palms. Drop your right knee down, point of foot up. Push the hip down. It's not much weight on the left, right knee. If you press the top of your right foot, there's not much weight on your right. And lift your arms up. Hold your right fist with your left arm. Lift the right side of the body. Inhale with exhalation. Bend your left. Breathe in and out. Keep activating your right lower leg. Press the top of your right foot. Activate down on the top. Inhale to center, exhale, release your arms, palms on the floor. Inhale, left leg back to ceiling or to plank. Exhale to chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Stay down to dog. Breathe in and out. Exhale out completely. With the inhalation, again jump either side of your palms. Keeping the knees and your feet in one line. Now come up. Come up. And from there, keep your right elbow, right forearm on your right thigh. Take the tailbone slightly in and stretch your left arm in line with the left side of the body. Left arm. In line with the left side of the body. Breathe in and out. Moving to the other side. Place the left forearm on your left leg. Stretch your right arm in line with the right side of the body. <laughs> Hip is centered. Good. Release. 
in both the forms of vein inhalation, jump back or step back, exhale to chaturanga, inhale, point the feet out, upward facing dog, <coughs> exhale, downward facing dog, and inhale, stretch your right leg to see, exhale, right foot in between palms, right foot in between palms, keeping the back heel off the floor, keeping the, from the heels to the back of the head, keep the body in one line and with inhalation, stretch your arms in line with the body, keep stretching the back of your left leg and keep stretching the sides of the body, yes, you press the right foot actively on the floor to activate your right leg that will give you more stability. Inhale with exhalation, arms on the floor. Inhale, right leg back. Exhale to Chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing down. Exhale, down facing down. Inhale, left leg lifted up, stretch your left leg, exhale. Bring your left foot in between palms, your left knee and your left hip and left foot in one line. Same with right leg. Now pressing the right left foot actively on the floor. Stretch both the arms in line with the body. Lift your chest slightly away from the knee. Keep stretching the back of your right leg. Inhale with exhalation, palms on the floor. Inhale, left leg. See, exhale to the leg. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Breathe in and out. If you feel you want to drop the knees down, sit back on your heels for a few seconds, you can do the same thing in downward. Stretch your arms out in front. Inhale, coming on to your arms. Exhale, push your hip back to seat. Inhale, right leg to seat. Exhale, bring your right foot in between palms. Right foot in between palms. Keeping the back heel on the floor with the inhalation. Stretch your left palm at the back of your left leg. We repeat the same pose. Exhale. Right forearm on your right leg. Stretch your left arm in line with the body. Make sure that you are rotating the left hip back. Maintaining the same posture without changing the alignment of this posture. Stretch your right arm in line with the right side of the body. You get more stability when you press your right foot actively on the floor. Slightly challenging posture, you can stay for another three breaths. And for a moment, time. inhale, bend your body back, exhale, place both palms on the floor. Inhale, right leg back, exhale to the right. Inhale up down. Exhale down facing dog. Inhale left leg lifted up. Exhale left foot in between palms. Right heel on the floor. With inhalation. Take your right palm at the back of your right leg. Stretch your left arm up and back. Exhale. Place your left forearm on your left leg. Stretch your right arm in line with the body. Activate your right leg by pressing the outer edge of the foot on the floor. Lift the chest up, tailbone slightly tucked in, rotate your right hip back. Good. Now maintaining the same posture, with inhalation, stretch your left arm in line with the left side of the body. Actively press the left foot on the floor. Breathe in and out. Another three breaths. Good. Place the elbow on the thigh with inhalation. 
left hand back, exhale, palms, both the palms of the floor. Inhale, left hip back, exhale, reach other end. Inhale, point the feet out, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Stay in downward dog. Breathe in and out. Exhale out completely with inhalation, jump either side of your palms. Good. Now bending the knees. Then come up. Again, place the right and right forearm on your right thigh, keeping the knees and your feet in one line. Stretch your left arm in line with the body. You make it slightly more challenging by stretching the right arm also in line with the right side of the body. Take a few breaths in and up. Just three breaths. And then release. You can stay in the legs. Take a few breaths in and out. Good. Again, bend your knees. And place your left forearm on your left thigh. Stretch your right arm in line with the right side. Maintaining the same alignment, keeping the hips ended, stretch your left arm in line with the left side. Breathe in and out. Two more breaths. Release, palms on the floor. Step back or jump back to plank. Exhale, chadrin. Inhale upward facing dog. Exhale downward facing dog. Can we take a little bit more time? We won't be stopping by 8 o'clock. And if some of you have to leave, um, by 7.50 you can start pulling down. We we'll continue till 8.15. Good. Inhale, stretch your right leg to see. Exhale, bring your right foot outside the mat to your left and keep your back heel on the floor. So you have both the palms and your foot in one line, heel is resting on the floor. And from there, you can stretch your left arm to seal. Stay here. Three breaths here. Good. Now drop the hip down. Draw the hip down on the floor. Now take your left palm with your back. Left palm with your back. Turn both the feet to left. Turn your both the feet to left. And lift your hip up. And stretch your right arm in line with the body. Again, we do a side stretch here. Keep both the feet grounded. And use your left palm to push your body away from the floor. One more breath. Good. Release. Now turn both the, turn the body towards the front. Palms either side of the mat. Take your back toes in. Inhale, right leg back. Exhale, reach other end. Inhale. Upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, left leg lifted up. Exhale, bring your left foot. Outside the mat on the right. Keeping the palm on the floor. Stretch your right arm to see. Keeping the left palm on the floor. Both, both the feet grounded. Three breaths. Drop the hip down. And take your right palm with your back. You don't you have, you have space. Turn both the feet to right and lift your hip up and stretch your left arm in line with the body. Both the feet grounded. Use your right palm to push your body away from the floor. Exhale. Drop the hip down. 
take the palm, see the side of your mat. Inhale, your left leg going back to ceiling. Exhale, each other in. Inhale, up foot facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Staying in downward dog. Exhale out completely with inhalation, jab in the side of the palms. Jab in the side of the palms. Again, keeping the feet and your knees in one line. Interlock the fingers, stretch your arms out. Inhale, with exhalation, move your body towards your right and stretch. Move your body towards the right, interlock the fingers. And your right side of the body coming in contact with the right hand. Inhale to center, exhale to left. Two breaths here. Inhale to center, exhale release. Inhale, jump back or step back. Exhale to chadrang. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. So we move to a spinal twist. Inhale, right leg lifted up. Exhale, right foot in between palms. Push your hips, drop the left knee down. Push your hip down. Take your left elbow. Outside the right. Palms together. And lift the bottom chest up. Lift the bottom chest up. Keep your right shoulder down. Take your left toes in now. You can lift your left knee off the floor. Without bending the back knee. Push your hip down. Activate your left foot. Middle of the chest lifted up. Good. Release palms on the floor. Inhale. Right leg back. Plant or lift it up to see. Exhale each other. In. Inhale up for facing dog. Exhale, down facing dog. Inhale, left leg lifted up. Exhale, bring your left foot in between palms. Point the right foot out. And take your right hand go. Outside the neck. Palms to the Press arm firmly against the leg to lift the middle of the chest up. Or even the bottom chest to your palms. Now take your back toes in. Lift your back knee off the floor. Push your hip down. Breathe in and up. Middle of the chest lift it up. Push the left hip down towards the floor. Lift your right hip up. Good. Release. Palms on the floor. Inhale, left hip. Back, exhale, chadrin. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down, facing dog. Now you can drop the knees down. Lie on your abdomen. Lie on your abdomen. And keep one palm on the other. Keep one cheek on the palm. Focusing on the breath. Feel the breath moving in. Feel the body moving with breath. Feel the breath moving out. Stay out. We move to a back bend here. We do the Nidasana. Then bend your knees. Bend your knees. And bring your heels to holding the, holding the top of the feet. Holding the top of the feet. Bring your heels to your butt and stay here for some time. Keep pressing the heels into your butt. 
Now move your palms to your ankles. Flex your feet. And with inhalation, lift your knees off the floor, lift your chest up. Make sure that your knees are not going out to the sides. Engage your inner thighs. And use your inhalation to lift your chest up. Breathe in and out. Release. We do one more round. This round, first press the palms on the floor, lift the chest up, up, and stretch the front of the body, and drop the chest down. Bend your legs, hold your ankles down. Let's stretch the front of the body, create space between the hip and your belly button. And flex the foot with the inhalation. Lift the chest up. So you are inhaling the chest. Exhale. Inhale the chest. Lift the body up. Good. Release. Again, keep the other palm on top. And keep the other cheek on the palm. And then. Focus on your breath. Focus on the body moving with breath. Good. And pressing the palms against the floor. Push the hip back. Push your hip back to downward facing down. And bring your both the knees more in front on the mat. Cross your legs at your ankles. Lie on your back. So we move to bridge and chakrasana. And then we do a spine like this. Keep your feet in line with your shoulders. Feet pointing out to the front. Arms by the side of the body. With the inhalation, lift your hip to the seat. And again, interlock the fingers. Take your shoulders in. Take your shoulders in. Connect with your feet. Press the feet actively down. Without moving the knees out to the side. Engage your inner thighs. And again, tighten your glutes for some time. Tighten your butts for some time. And lift your hip up. And then you can lightly engage your glutes. Bring your chest towards the chin, keeping the chin neutral. Connect with your feet. Use your feet to lift your feet up. Good. Release. Drop the hip down. Take three breaths in and out. Now we move to Chakrasana, take your palms over the shoulders, fingers pointing in towards your feet. Now pressing the palms and feet against the floor. If you are not that flexible, move your feet further forward. If you are flexible, keep your heels close to your hip. Now with the inhalation, lift yourself up. Again, same way like what we did in bridge. Point the feet out to the front, engage your inner thighs. And use your feet to lift your hip up. At the same time, use your palms to lift your chest. So you can use your feet to open your chest by pressing the feet against the floor. We do one more round. You take three breaths in and out. Okay. Press the palms on the floor. With inhalation, lift your hip up. Lift your chest up. Connect with your hip. Connect with your palms. Keep lengthening the arms. 
keep activating your legs. Whenever you want to release, you can release. Good. Now hug your knees to chest. Hug your knees to chest. Keeping the back of the head on the floor. Take few breaths in and out. Stretch your arms out at shoulder level, palms facing down, keeping the knees and thighs together. Inhale with exhalation, both the knees right on the floor. You can, you can take the support of your right arm, but make sure that you are not separating the leg. Inhale to center, pressing the right arm down. Exhale, taking the support of your left arm, exhale, both the knees on the floor. Inhale to center, exhale and turn your head to the opposite side. Few rounds, right to left and left to right. Complete on the left side. Come to center and stretch your legs out in front. We move to Sarvadasana, Halasana, and Matsyasana. Coming to Sarvadasana, lifting the body, supporting the body with your palms, bring your elbows in. Moving the palms more close to your shoulder blades. <coughs> Stay here, few breaths. and shoulders in one line. You can choose to stretch your arms out to the sides or you can interlock the fingers or you can even support the body. Walk your feet away from the hip to keep the hip and shoulders in one line. If there is space, if you need to. Switch your legs out. Moving to Matsyasana. Okay. Either hold the side of the thighs or you can press the palms against the floor. In the top of the head, onto the floor, lift the chest up. Keep the legs together, point the feet up. arms over the head. A nice long stretch.
We turn the body to one side, come to sitting posture. We do a spinal twist here. You can move to Ardhana Sindrasana and stretch your right leg out, bending your left foot. Yes, bending knee. Bring your heel close to heel. Take your elbow out. Press the arm firmly to the side of the leg. Take your palm at your back, lift your chest up. Make sure, make sure that both the sitting bones are on the floor. And you can come to. And you can bring the palms to the floor. Make sure that you are sitting right on the sitting bone, not in the back or not the front of the sitting bone. And keep your spine upright. Lift the middle of the chest without arching the lower back. Focusing on the breath. Each inhalation, keep the chest lifted up. Each exhalation, a little bit more deeper into the chest. Good, release. So we, we do one pranayama, we do kapalabhadra, we do 20 stops and we move to jalandrapanda and mulapanda. Sitting straight, focus on your breath. When you are next exhaling, Forcefully pull the abdomen in to push the breath out. When you are pulling the abdomen in, make sure that you are tightening the pelvic floor. Exhale out completely. And inhale slowly and deeply. Keep the breath in, press the chin to chest and tighten the pressure top. Stay as long as you are comfortable. Whenever you want to exhale, release the pelvic floor contraction, lift your chin up, then exhale. Stay as long as you are comfortable. Once you exhale, keep your face relaxed. Keep your mouth slightly open. 
you focus inside the pocket. Effortlessly, feeling the sensations inside the pocket. Without disturbing the state of mind, I am back. We do a ten minute shavasana. Feet as wide as your shoulders, keeping the shoulders just in one floor. Separate your arms. Your chin slightly tucked in. The jaws separated. Cheeks soft. At your eye pods, rest in the socket. And look at the back of your head. The right is softly resting on the right edge. Take one long deep breath in and out. And set it down. Connecting with the body. Feel your body resting on the floor. Consciously allow the body to relax into the floor. Connect with your breath. Without changing the inclination, without changing the inclination, very gently extend your exhalation. Let the breath be as it is, and now controlling the exhalation. Connect with the breath and stay with the breath. You are conscious of each breath coming in, you are conscious of each breath going out. subtle sensations with the breath.
shifted around to the space behind forehead. Space behind. Close eyes. Observing that space. The dark space. See how far in going to that space. As your observation becomes relaxed, and see this darkness is disappearing, then see streaks of light, images, pictures, keep observing this space, effortless. If you feel like staying a little bit longer, you can stay. Others connect with the state of mind. Connect with the breath. Connect with the body. Breathe in deep. Breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe out. Move your fingers, move your toes. Stretch your feet, stretch your arms. Then you head right, left, left, right. And give a nice long stretch. Turning the body to one side. Come to sitting posture. Arms either on the knees or palms in the middle of the chest. We end the class. Three oaks and long shaft. Inhale.
เดนโทอืมเหตุนะเป็นตัวเดียวกันเดี๋ยวเจ้าเนี่ยเฟสไอส์เฟสดาวน์ที่โชว์เดนส์ต่อ Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You need to sort. Have a good day, all of you. Stay posted. We may host a yin yoga this evening. Ah, uh, it will be on Facebook. <laughs>